It's about to get messy for motorists around the Tucson Mall. Starting Sunday night, road work begins on Auto Mall Drive from Oracle to Wetmore, and that means lane closures. Work will begin days after on Wetmore from First Avenue to Stone. And clear over on the east side, work began on 22nd Street from Kolb to Craycroft. Crews will begin ripping up the road this week to prepare for the layers of asphalt. You may have noticed crews cleared out of Kolb Road last week, leaving motorists with a smooth ride. KGAN 9's Valerie Cavazos joins us now, and Valerie, the city is certainly fulfilling its promise to repair Tucson roads. Now that's right. All that road construction paid by Tucson taxpayers is estimated it costs each motorist $400 a year. Much of it pays for the asphalt. Tons of it. We take you up close to show you how it's made and how the company is trying to stretch your tax dollars. This is the asphalt that covers our roads. About 3,000 tons a day flows into these trucks from these three towering silos at Granite's Swan Plant. Bill Mackey is the plant manager. The drum that you see turning is the drying drum. It dries the aggregates, rocks, sand, and minerals that are fed to the plant and heats them to 325 degrees. It goes into another drum where the oil is added, and then from that point, the material is transported up to the backside of these silos. Each silo holds 280 tons. 15% of the hot mix is recycled asphalt, asphalt that's ripped up from the roads and end up at the plant in huge heaps. How much money does that save the taxpayers? Uh, that saves, on average, uh, a fair number would be $2 a ton. Granite alone will provide 45,000 tons to help cover the 112 miles for the Road Recovery Street Bond Program in the next fiscal year. And for the potholes that pepper neighborhood streets, a different mixture is used. This is cold to the touch, right? It's cold to the touch. That accounts for a small fraction, only 5%, of the asphalt produced for Tucson roads. And this is just for uh, Tucson streets. Add county road projects and work on highways through Tucson. It's estimated that 700,000 tons of asphalt is produced to cover Tucson Metro roads a year. Guy? Thanks, Bill.